colors on our skin We were light and paper thin And when we first came here We were cold and we were clear With no colors on our skin Till we let the spectrum in Say my name This is how you'd all come travelling to France in an electric EV and you say to Dave, Dave just cut down your gear a bit mate, you've been definitely put the kitchen sink and now we have to charge even more. But luckily enough for us, John who's probably watching this now will do various things when it comes round to it, moaned like fuck about getting stuff in France so it makes it a little bit funny, a bit more spicy. <laughs> Yes, right, I'm on my way to France. I'm with uh, my homie, Curran Bun. Curran, How are you doing, Curran Carp. Make sure you check out his video as well. <laughs> yeah, it's probably shit, but we'll, we'll try <laughs> our best. <laughs> yeah, we're going to Belfast. Um, on our way now, we're in Milton Keynes, uh, Jake, in electric car. Oh, so, uh, yeah, it's been interesting, but yeah, it's uh, just, just charging it up now, we are. Yes, yeah, people looking at us like, like we're weirdos. Hey, I bet we look like them people that like, chat like proper love EVs, like proper like <laughs> yeah. glowing that we're at. We're at Ion, uh, a, What are we at? Ionic? A, a, Ionic set charger and it is going really fast. I give it a 7 out of 10. The facilities are great. We have a cup of tea. And uh, yes, <laughs> yeah. to be an EV driver for a greener yeah. world. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, so that's where we're at at the minute. We're on the way to France, we're going to catch some, well, we're going to catch some big fish. Keep watching because um, PB is going to be broken, I think. And I'm just going to carry on playing the game. Yeah, so we're going to wait for the charge, play the games, and we'll see you in France. Right, it's videoing now, mate. Right then, so, first fish, um, what time is it? About half twelve? Yeah, about well, yeah. This grass cart went absolutely bonkers. To be fair, the lads have had a load of pass, pass on. I just pass on champ. Is that pass it? on shats? Pass on shats. Well, pass on shits. Yeah, and then um, <laughs> I just had a couple of bleeps on my rod. So I've gone out, looked at it, and I've got a little drop back. So I thought, oh, wow, it's it. And then it just curled over to this absolutely bonkers grass cart. I've had it in the net twice. And it's swam out. And it's probably gearing up to knock me out as well in here. So if you've ever had grass cart before, you'll know how mad they actually are. This one's got a net around 22 pound. I'm not gonna keep it out long. But yeah, um, off to the belly fast start, first carp. Had a nightmare today as well. My boat stopped working. It's it's going around the lake now, it's lights on, it has been for the last six hours, it's not working receiver. Um it's just one thing after another, so yeah, it's good to get off the off the mark, even with a mad grass carp. But yeah, first French fish, first French fish, <laughs> can't speak, I'm that tired. But yeah, I'm gonna get it back. Um, we'll try and get some more. <sighs> now remember from the time of Wednesday, <laughs> that grass cart take a little bit longer to recover than your average cart. It's good to get a lot of running out of girls. Yeah, the last laugh. That's what the standard of cooking you get from little Johnny. Cruncher, juicer. Fair play, well then, little Johnny. What I'm going to do is 
riding a margin with a camouflage. I'll never see her coming. Look, on a free line, a bit of um, what have we got? A bit of tigers, and just lie down flat with this. I'm bound to catch 50 pounder. What do you reckon? <laughs> yeah, I see the camera light and them lights. That's Jonna and Judd. They've both got um, <laughs> nice Titans with no front on. And the wind's absolutely hacking over us, sitting our back, hitting <laughs> them right in the front. So <laughs> I think uh, a couple of divvies have blown up a little bit. It's absolutely solid over there. On concrete, so we can either get the pegs in, and all I can see is lights moving around, picking up stuff. So, yeah, it's absolutely chucking it down. Well, all right then, so I don't know what time it is. This one's ripped off, I'm going to bolt for about 20 minutes. Pardon me, being a bit naked, I was ripped, ran out of bed. Good, I was in the boat day for half hour. Yeah, about. I would have thought it would have been 40 or 50, might add it. It's gone 23. Um, good scrap, Jesus, was it? Good scrap. But yeah, I have to mark for a king carp anyway. Had a grass carp and get it back, but just come over here, Dave, just show everyone the tail on this. This is what I was greeted with at first. There's my hand for a comparison. So when I seen that, I thought, whoa, it's a big fish. But hey, not lose the moan. It's right free, and I've never had a fish with a tail like that. Sure knows how to use it. But, we'll see, we'll see. Swish. <laughs> These things are insane. It's like having a dog on a lead in a net, a grass carp. Second one on the trip. That's a quick one, I'm doing the pictures with this. Yeah, get it back. You can see it. Yeah, long fingers here, it's fins. Some kyla, some, some treat that. <sighs> right then, uh, second carp in the night. Third actually, I've had a grassy as well. I didn't film that, just flopped it back. Um, Pub truck, this to be honest, it's half five. Been up all right, haven't we, Alex? Yep. Um, so, yeah, this one went at, what is it, 23? 23, yeah. 23, so, yeah. Another one to the teller. It's been kicked off tonight after the storm. But, uh, no, day, night number two. And the lads are catching everywhere. Judd lost one before, which was a bit shit. But Alex has had a 47 and a half pound grass there, so I can't wait to see the pictures of that in the morning. But, yeah. Get this back and get some fucking sleep as well. I'm knackered. It's too right, mate. <laughs> there you go. Go Well, this was a nice little wake up call. Uh, led me right to Merry Dance. What time uh, is it? Uh, it went off at about four o'clock. Half four. Half four now. Uh, yeah. Uh, tiger up and corn combo. Um, it's doing the job at the moment. Um, wiped out all my rods through uh, grass carp style. But she's gone 51 with the sling. The sling's uh, four pound, so it's a 47 pound grasser. And there she is. Get that. Now. <laughs> Look at that. Nice man. 47 pound grass carp. My first ever grass carp. So it's going to take a while to do some beating for this. Uh, but yeah, over the moon. Let's get some stills of her. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh mate! <laughs> so we're uh, just out putting rods out for Dave. Dave's first time in a boat putting his rigs out and he's gone over the fucking line. Well done Dave. <sighs> it's stuck in the motor, I think. <laughs> just got it in a nice spot, dink. Just tightened the line up for him and it just went and started taking it. So yeah. Currently out in the middle of the pond, trying to unwind it all. I want to say well done, Dave. 
<laughs> He's fuming at this minute in time, but he'll probably watch this back and laugh, hopefully. Right, I'll catch you later. Right then, how are we doing everyone? It's day, we're on now, Tuesday. Um, not much to report, let's shift this camera up a bit. Not much to report. Um, bikes seems to win all at night. I, um, it's happened again now, right? But yesterday, last night, not last night, like four, I had a double take. And last night, just got to sleep, and um, middle rod's gone off. It's a, fair, it's a bit of a finicky bite, so it feel, felt like a grass car. Reels in, reeling it, snag, and then I was doing that. My um, right hand rod does a drop back, so it puts the rod down. Sorry, I kept my middle rod up trying to bring, get it in. Goes out and then um, snagged, fish is gone. It's a massive log. This lake is absolutely full of snags. I'm not talking like little ones, there's trees underneath the water everywhere. I went out in the waders before, and it's, yeah, it's, it's quite bad. So, yeah, brought that up. And then that, that was a big trunk, unhooked it, come back to the um, come back um, to me back in the boat and then went out to the second one, the right hand rod that was snagged, lifted it up. I think it was about half one in the morning, so the mist is just on the water. Like that, and it's went and as it snapped, I've gone ass over to it. Hit me side off the boat and I was literally this close, this close from going in. Um I said to John, little Johnny across the on the nets. Um, over the water, said if it would have gone in, it would have been funny. I seems an head torch. The live track would have set off and me blowing a whistle <laughs> to go and get some out to get out. So, ah, uh, that's where we're up to so far. Been out to tackle shop today, got some more bits. A uh, French McDonald's, which is better than at home. Really, really nice. And then, um, found some spots, went out with Carp and I got Dave. Went right across the margins, probably into it, found some lovely spots. So, Brought them in now close off, left the bait and right hand side free on purpose just to give the fish some space. And last night I heard an absolute unit jump out. So it was I was like, fucking hell, that sounds big. So baited that up today. We've gone from Atlantic Heat to some Cremino, some Tigers, some Manila. Loaded it up, put them out, gone out with the boat, put them on. Same rigs as you've probably already seen. And um, yeah, it's, it seems to happen at night. Um, Dave's now had three or four grass carp, one normal carp, 19. Judd's had three grass carp, not had a proper carp yet, king carp. Alex, little Johnny, has had a bream, <laughs> a massive, absolute slab of bream. It's a running joke with where, where he goes, he always catches a bream, and this was like an absolute unit of a bream. Um, and he got a 27 and a half coming last night, it was really nice to be fair. So yeah, bit of change tactics. I've got my rods fully locked up now, so if I do, it's just a matter of it hit them and, and walk back. Um, but yeah, sort of same old really. Apologies for not getting much footage. You're probably sick of seeing me now in this little bit of a, um, waffling on. I will get a bit more this week on it. It's just been absolute one thing after another after another. Gone out in a boat, finding spots, bait it up, um, do types of new rigs. It's same old stuff really, and I'm new to it, so I'm trying to find time to get it in but highlight of yesterday was um, Dave was his head was going a bit because he was blanking and then um, he caught a grasser and then he caught as he was getting it in his other rod once so he had two grasses in the net and then he said um, oh, I've never, never done this before I had two in the net so as he's walked down it's all sleeping Stephen Bowman uh, it's, it's yeah I'll, I'll touch on the place at the end um, and he went ass over to it I'm talking legs in the air boom you know I'm tip I just cried laughing, so I hope that's on his vlog. But yeah, sorry to ramble on a bit. I'll get you updated with what's going on, and uh, yeah, hopefully, hopefully, I get some fish in it because all of them have been at night, so they've been caught on, on phone and stuff like that, which I'll get a video off the lads and put in. But I just really want one in a day so I can get one and do some filming, some pictures. But yeah, um, like I said, hopefully, next time, see me if you've got fish or. Um, um, yeah, I know. Next time I see him, we've got fish. What a while since we've got Seema. You just come watch it to watch fishing, don't you? Don't come here to watch me ramble on. <laughs> oh, big, big though, mate. It's a
Is it a grasser? Grasser. At least you're off the mark, kid. That's the one, mate. Been waiting for it. Yeah. Jordan's first blood. Yeah. There we go. Let her go. Go on. There she goes. Well in, mate. Well yeah, done. Mate. Definitely worked for. Definitely, <laughs> definitely worked for. One sec. Go on. Make sure they just put the rod down there to do it. Stop it in that way, lad. Yeah. Literally. Go. Bring it up again, I said. I've got it. Foul looks as well. <laughs> Little Johnny thinking he's catching a big in there. Oh, mate, you can't have that a bit weight in the back. No! Pass on shot and a Well done, Johnny. I think you might need the net for that, mate. I'm hoping it falls well. Do you know what, mate? It's fucking it's lassoed itself, right? Fucking hell. Right. Right, I need to get my finger. Get me. Right then. Got one. We had one a couple of hours ago. That's come off the uh, left hand margin spot. Just on the line as well, that. But yeah, but that thing's only like £23, that one. Johnny and uh, Judd, I've got, Judd's got a £45 um, carp in, and Johnny's got 30 odd, so we'll get some footage from there. Good last night, I'm not sure. If Carp Nags had anything, I've not heard from him, but hopefully I will soon find out. Go. Yeah, wreck. Right. right then. Did say Wednesday? Mm hmm. I had uh, this mirror a couple of hours ago, so put it in sling to get a bit of sunlight. Gone, I think it's 20, 23 something. It's a lovely dumpy mirror. It's absolutely full of beans as well. Um, it'll be a unit this when it's older. So I can tell by its colour. It took me about 10 minutes to get the picture. I'll joke, won't keep this out long. But uh, throw it up for that. If she behaves. Yeah. Yeah, I'm getting back in a minute. As you can tell, she's having absolutely none of it. But. The star of the show is with Judd and little Johnny who's behind the camera. Um, 45 in that and a fur. So I'll get this one back before it jumps out even more. My fish get it's all over the dancer. Making a bloody show with me. Trying to get you on YouTube <laughs> and you're acting like that. <laughs> hey, what, where's this? He is at your pants, Dan. Last time, right, I promise. I know. Bloody hell. More right, actually than my daughter. Right, that's it. Look, French fish. Put it back to me. Twenty three pound. Love the little scrap. Musty. Now let's go and look at your fish. Mm. Yeah, boy. And then, so. And then, and then, so we're gonna do, do the and then we can get the out. Been a busy night for Al. Very busy night. I said, you know what? As well, I said Jordan was saying to me because obviously he's, he's not been off the mark yet. But proper carp strains he's like really really like I want to catch you a really big one I was like I said listen so it felt right last night the lake was dead calm it felt like it was due a big and out and a fair play to him because he's got a pretty special one in the net these two here are pretty special but, but yeah, you're pretty special as well aren't you yeah, <laughs> uh, so yeah so let's get these out and um, I'm going to re-weigh this one because I'm not really too 
100% sure on what the actual weight was. Um, I think it was 25 without the sling. So I'm going to get her out and we'll see how we get on. What have we got here then, lads? <laughs> you Big girl. Starve the show so far. <laughs> Giving it big licks already, innit? I can't oh wait to see you try all this now. Don't be like that, Jenna. Wow, that is a beast. <laughs> yeah, I know I'm gonna wear. Right, we need to move her more to the middle. No. All the sling, the fish in the sling. Yeah, brother. Yeah. I have to wear the sling after it. Yeah. Moment of truth. Lift it, Jod. Everyone after, yeah? Yeah. Nine three, it's gone. Oh, is it seven? Three, yeah. Forty nine three. So take the sling off, so you're probably looking at about forty five something there. Yeah. We shall call her Shamu. <laughs> what did you have on Jard? A balanced tiger nut. Did you? Yeah. My rig? The, no, oh. you made me own. Used a bit of cork out of the wine bottle at Johnny Bar, didn't it? <laughs> <laughs> so, so basically, he's got the, piss, the, the fish pissed and took advantage. That's how I've caught it. Took advantage of a pissed fish. Hey <sighs> 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 Come on, Judd. <laughs> Come <laughs> on, make him give a little lick. <laughs> keep it still, lads. Keep still. Keep still. Hold on. Let's zoom in there a little bit. Yeah, that's it. Look at Alex like you love him. Laugh at him. <laughs> right, it's a bit higher, boys. Lift the higher. Oh, fucking hell. Shoot the last one for a dildo Right, last one to keep still, lads. There we go. Good snaps. There we go. Getting back. Let's get him back. Oh, baby. What's that little lump in your way? Is that? I'm a little bit excited. <laughs> 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 so I've done it in that format was when we went to France last time, it took me ages to edit. I'm not as thingy as you, like you just dropping out what you're on about, do you know what I mean? Ah, oh, poor mate, it's okay, you wouldn't think it, would you? <laughs> so Dave, we're um, three days in. <laughs> tell the audience what you've got. Jordan laughing, will tell the audience what I've got. Do you know what, right, since they're that part of the you've been a bit of smug, in there. <laughs> been getting a bit right. getting, getting a bit lemon. George said he didn't want to be on the camera because he, he <laughs> thinks he's a higher caliber than that because I've caught lower twenties. Dave, <laughs> Dave's I'm, got high doubles. I'm not even caught a twenty. Have I? Not even the grassies with it twenty. <laughs> <laughs> what, what, was that, what was that coming you had? Nineteen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, four four mid double grassies. Snagged up twice, lost a, a 19 pound common. Well, I could have stayed in England and caught. <laughs> <laughs> I've had, um, is it three or four? You've had four, all, all 20s. All. Four, four lower 20s. Like, mm -hmm. I've not even like weighed them, I've just, I have weighed them, I've not even like weighed things like cutting over like 30 something. I know I'm single weighs four pounds, so I just flopped in the back. But little John here is on a barbecue. I just wanted to take his time to say, Dave, you want to catch a monster, mate? I hope so. It's my turn, isn't it? No, it's fine. Last night, I won't. Well, I won't. So selfish. It's my turn. Why are you thinking about yourself? Stop it. You, no, you're, you just said it's my turn. Okay. Why is it not my turn? Who cares? Who's video? I put more graphics in you. <laughs> <laughs> my, my, my turn. Everyone caught a cart last night. I could have, apart from me. So it's my turn. 
I think the audience is the truth. They don't catch me when he stays in bed till 12 o'clock in the afternoon. <laughs> Half to sad, Half to sad. And he's got to do some boils in the little door. Watch my video and I'll show you the state of my head. We've been absolutely like, annihilated yeah. by Moses. I've got like numerous fucking. I keep, I keep saying effing. Oh, that, guy, out, yeah. that guy off Philadelphia, Andrew <laughs> yeah. Beckett. <laughs> Numerous bites. Dave's got um, Susan Boylehead, and then little Johnny was giving <laughs> giving it big licks, slapping at Dave. I know. Johnny like fucking dartboard. So you're a teenager, you're going through fucking puberty, you got all the boils. Yeah. Your balls not dropping. <laughs> <laughs> mine's still, mine's still participating in that. But yeah, we've got, um, is it three nights three now? Three nights still to go. Three nights left. Plenty of time, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Judd's got one, absolute blues all the water with 45. Lord Johnny's got two thirties. I've had some steady twenties and a two or three grass garp. It's that bad though, grass garp, like when I see him come in, I just think fall off, just fall off the hook. Well, that bloke, when last he fished the week before, he said I'm a 41 fish, didn't it? We didn't say what. Yeah, 40 then with grass yeah, garp. 40 with grass garp. Talk about Johnny's starfish as well. Oh yeah, Johnny. <laughs> right. Yeah, I don't. I don't. Honestly, because I'm not first time logging, but little Johnny manages to breathe everywhere he goes. When the pool, right? Everywhere he goes, he's <laughs> breathing. You. Like, it's not even like. Ten no, pounds. Ten pounds or something, but it's not yeah, even it's like. Big breed, it? Everyone documented in this. I always said what they caught. No one's documented it being, but little Johnny went step aside, hold me beer, and pulled out a ten, <laughs> ten pound breathe. <laughs> Absolutely, <laughs> union. <laughs> so yeah, it's been funny today. It's been hard though. Um, yeah. What you've got on one side is this lovely cabin right here, off with a nice deck in, luxurious, and the other side is just nettles, <laughs> nettles <laughs> and, and brambles. So me and Carp and I are on the opposite side because there was a bit of um, fixing in the draw. We're not very <laughs> really tough, but like, yeah. Yeah, we got to open yeah, it. Yeah, but some don't know how, but we no, jokes aside, I've written numbers on the, the pop ups that he picks out. So fair play to him. Um, Sorry. Do you want your burger, barbecue sauce, and ketchup? And your chicken? Or do you want to just have it as it is? Hold barbecue, please, mate. Barbecue. Come, come here, come here. Come here, come here. Come here, baby bikers. Shows you that. Come here. <laughs> come here, come on, look. Oh, it's here, you see the screen. Look. This, this is Wee Jaundice. Wee Jaundice, the chef. You'll, you'll see him carrying the units round on, on the video. If you want for you, we fucked. I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> Every day I'm going to stay in England, it's not worth it. Stay in England, it saves your money. So yeah, um, just round up. We're on a barbecue tonight. We want to watch United get spanked 4-0 off of our oh, unit. God. Dave's going to pull out a monster and put pressure on me tomorrow. What's that? Clock. Oh, fingers crossed. I didn't know. It's only his fingers crossed. You just need to make right. it happen. Now try. Try and clear. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I'll probably check in tomorrow. Hung over slightly. Um, yeah, we'll go from there. What do you reckon tonight, gents? Yeah. I reckon Dave's gonna have a four. Eh? Oh, I'm gonna have a scrape a seat, a scrape a double. Judd's gonna have a a twenty if he deserves one and John will pull up pull out on the further. Eh? But you know what's the best yeah, thing do you know what the best thing about it is they all do well back for me. I can get any to shower and cry no way <laughs> right till next time just went to get a uh, picture of us all and Judd's <laughs> Rod's lifted up how's it feeling Judd? was it mate hopefully it's another unit sorry check yeah. it's alright mate no it's ok hey, do you know what it feels alright I've not got a mic on it anyway Dave to be fair Music on it. Can't even left. He robs it off, pull it up. That's it. That's it. Just like a slow jump. That'd be good, wouldn't it? Scatty's a grass cat. Life flooding. No, not really, it just feels like a dead weight. That's what you want. Big cat, that. Be a bream. <laughs> <laughs> 30 pound bream. Why is that dude now?
Ooh, I'll move some water that. Normal car. I don't know if you had your net in, what is what I'm doing by now. <laughs> oh, fucking the drone was working. Grab it up there, couldn't I? I'm going to fly it up over land now. Oh, it's the camera's fucking pissing about, isn't it? Yeah, just keep it landed at one spot. Keep the smokers down. Hug the margin so well, don't they? And she's yours. The best nettle nice. there is, isn't it, Johnny? Don't mess about. The brother to my one, mate, the other night. It's a fish, though, Judd. It's a carp, mate. It's such a fucking grassy hard off, though. Seems to be having mine during the day. Talk to me. What's <laughs> happened? Just lost the biggest thing of butts all week. Close in as well, so. I ain't got my gigs on ever. Can't even see. Um, put it back out in the boat. Jake's kindly sorted his rods out. <laughs> Get the boat out. I'm gonna go and put it back on the shelf now because I'd be stupid not to. Anyway. Feel like a lump. Ooh, nearly got it on camera. <laughs> nice little wake up call. She's gone 30 pounds, three ounces with the sling, so we do need to wear the sling. I feel that this one, the Nash one's probably going to be about three pounds. It's probably going to be 27 pound three. So nice first comment of the trip for me. Uh, and she's not a bad one at all, is she? So. Like I say, we're gonna get some skill, get some stills of her, uh, and get her back. But I'm more than happy to be woken up by this. Uh, but yeah, uh, so we're gonna get some stills of her, and we'll get her back. And yeah, fantastic. Right then, after losing four fish, going out on the boat at night when we're getting all our runs and getting snagged. Took evasive action. I'm removing the fucking snag out of the spots. So, yeah, it's absolutely low. So, I said to Dave, jump in a boat with her. We've gone out, and about to take this snag out as well. Deserve a fish for all this craft. Jump out, though, because she's all snaggy, Yeah, bell snag. It snapped. Yeah, just. Fold it back on itself and put it on the bank, on the margin, mate. It's out of the way then, isn't it? There we go. Fucking size Look of that. that. Not caught any bigger than caught a big snag. Moral of the story, this fucking place. Sorry about the effing and jeffing as well. Yeah. Look at that wild slimer. Yeah.
Good morning. Last day, Friday. Big fish first last night. And to be fair, I had a. <laughs> or just a little sign out there, right? Um, this whole trip, Alex, aka Little Jonah, has not stopped saying, to be fair. So every time he says it now, it just makes me laugh. Every sentence is, to be fair, to be fair. But um, yeah, so Thursday yesterday, um, I had a bit two days, a bit quite quiet, didn't have anything. Um, two days, yeah, two nights, didn't have anything. So changed one of the spots right up to the snags, fish locked up. The fish that was doing me, the spot was doing me normal fish, that sort of dried up and died to death. So yeah, I put two on different spots last night, and um, two went one because I'm fishing locked up. I went up and was coming back slow, reeled in, and um, the lead was still there. I'm fishing on heli safe, so if it was fish, five ounce lead, it would have gone. I'm using five ounce lead because we were going out in the boat and dropping them. Um, won't be able to cast five ounce lead with a 3.25 test skirt brad, probably end up snapping it. Um, got, so I had one last night with middle rod, um, locked up, couple of bleeps, walked back, and to be honest, it wasn't. Um, that hard, it come in, you know it's big fish because they don't worry about little fish do they? they just come in slow and just stick to the bottom got that in the net um, slung it up and we had it about 4 or 5 this morning so the net I always want to go over and do some proper pictures once the sun comes up um, start packing up stuff today everything's sodden it's just bounced it down all day yesterday and it's um, been raining this morning so yeah a bit of a pack up get everything in the motor um, Got to go to charge my EV as well down the road. What I would say if you come into France in a EV, there is lots of charges everywhere. Um, it's not it's not that bad at all. So no one gets in fear anxiety, driving anxiety with them, but no, it's fine. But yeah, I've tried to keep this video um, sort of not just me in this bither, like you see in a lot of other vlogs. It, it bores me a little bit, not Sam Rude when he does it. Um, like I said, it's my first one, mine might change over time now, I'm sat in the Vivian, most of it. But I've just took a load of videos in and everywhere, um, with us and the lads. And like I said, it's our final day today. It's September now, I don't know how long it'll take me to get this out, first time ever making one. But yeah, what I'll do is, we'll do, get another fish, we'll film it. Um, we'll film the one that I'm about to get out of the sling anyway, you'll see that. And then um, I'll do a bit of filming with the lads today, ask them how the session's been, what the thought of it, etc, etc. But, um, yeah, I hope it's fair. I think it just goes about fair. Come France twice and that, right? Last time, I think the ice was 29, um, 8 or something like that. And then the quite a lot of 20s this time. I think I'll catch them at home. <laughs> Syndicate's full of them, 20s. And for a couple of 30s and the 40s, so I could have done this at home. But, however, Seeing Judd catch that 45, little Johnny catch a couple of 30s. Dave as well, oh Dave as well, uh, only had one carp. Last night he caught one, I think it was a 23. Beautiful carp, mint, proper, scaly, lovely thing. Um, you'll see that in his, in his vlog, it's really smart. But yeah, not to boys, everyone too much. I wanna crack on with my morning coffee. This is the, um, the Lucky Cup. No, it's not Christmas, but take it with me everywhere all year round. Got a little West Day, see? And it looks just like that. So, yeah, lucky cup. Um, I'll show you my mix as well, if I remember at some point. But this place is, I said I won't want to rock one, but waffling the bit and what I'm doing, waffling. But yeah, last little bit. This place is full of grass carp and pass on shant, what it's called. So, most of the mix has consisted of tiger nuts. But like I said, I'll show you. I've got a little bit of bait left. I fill that in today. But yeah, thanks for listening to me waffle on. So as promised is the mix. Now I've just added a load more ties in this, but basically what we've got is a load of vanilla. Um not vanilla. Cremino from Bait Works. Uh, Cremino. It's been soaking for days. Freezer baits in here as well, no shelf life. And then um, tigers, jumbo tigers, little tigers, all glugged in Manila. Like I said, a lot of possum champ in there, so it's highly suggest you get on the tigers. Right then, 29. 
Uh, waited quite a bit, time for a bigger one. Come this morning, slung it up, done the pictures. It's bouncing down. We've got a car pub going over there, towel <laughs> over. Johnny's penis in Judd's back, get some pictures. <laughs> but yeah, we'll get her back, my arms are on fire. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of paddle on this as well? What note is these French fish? Look at the size of that. When they go, they go. Some paddle that in it, so. Yeah. For that, it's been shitting. Tiger nuts out, as you can see, all over the sling. Jake milk in the cart. Look at the size of its thingy as well, the eyes cart, that's my thumb. The size of its eyes. And the gob on it as well. How's it not, se how, how's it not seen your rig with all the eyes? Look at that as well. Yeah, it's a golf ball. Isn't it? I'm not, not to say names, but Johnny would put something in there if you had a chance. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you.